Hey, Gloria McDonald here. Bah humbug. So this is a little bit of a different uh, video I'm doing for you. The big question is, what do my Christmas decorations and your prospects have in common? Well, a ton. I'm going to take you on a brief little tour here and hang in here with me so that you can see what the connection is. So I'm here in my front hallway and I'm going to flip the camera around here. You can see that I've got, uh, here we go, I've got my black and silver stockings on my doors there because, or sorry, black and gold, because the theme in my hallway here, as you can see, is black and gold. Hey guys, hey Krista, hey Mary, hey Cameron. And, and I've got this uh, orange and gold frame painting. So down here I have gold Christmas trees and I have a gold deer uh, pillow and another gold Christmas tree in the lamp there. So I've got black and gold going on here in my hallway. And then I'm just gonna walk down here and take you on a tour into my kitchen because the theme changes. So in my kitchen here, you can see I've got red and gold going on. Got some red and gold Christmas balls there and candles. I've got uh, red and gold going on over here by my stove over there. I've got some more red Christmas trees. And then obviously my uh, kitchen opens into my dining room area. So I've gotten more into gold here in the dining room gold uh, trees, gold reindeer and candles, because you see, I've got this Christmas china, which is all, you know, uh, a holly pattern in red and gold. And then I've got this gold Christmas tree over here in the corner, gold and bronze orangey that goes with my orange painting. And then I've got gold over here on my uh, table here. And then hang in because you'll see, <laughs> you'll see what this has to do with your prospects. So then I move into my thing is white and silver. And so you can see I've got uh, silver and, and white going on here on my little buffet there. I've got, I didn't put up a big tree this year. I'm being, uh, <laughs> I'm trying to be efficient on my time. So I've got silver and white Christmas trees there. And you can see all my decorations here are basically a silver thing and I've got my silver pillow. So now let me flip this. Okay, so I'm gonna flip my camera around because we lost connection there. Okay, so what does all that have to do with anything? What do my Christmas decorations have to do with your prospects? Well, only everything. You see, not every room in my house is the same. The rooms in my house are different. So I have coordinated my Christmas decorations with the various rooms in my house. So some are gold, gold and black. Some are red and gold. Then the living room is silver and white. And here's the thing, not all of your prospects are the same. So if you start treating your prospects, if you treat your prospects as if they're all the same, when you're having those sales and closing conversations with them, when you're trying to recruit someone onto your team or even sell them your product, it's not going to work. So you need to treat your prospects like I treat the different areas of my home for my Christmas decorations. So, you know, we're just not all the same. Now, there are tons of different uh, personality tests that you can take, uh, whether it's um, NLP testing or Myers-Briggs or Enneagram or True Colors or DISC profiling. There are all kinds of different person personality profiles out there, and I've done a ton of them, and you've probably done a bunch of them too, but here's the thing. How on earth do you ever use that when you're talking to a prospect, whether it's on a Zoom call or a phone call, and let's say it's somebody who you really don't know well. How, I mean, you're not gonna get them to go through one of those personality tests to figure out who they are. So I have learned so much from my amazing friend and colleague, Debbie Mentor, Debbie, Debbie Morton, <laughs> sorry, Debbie Morton, and I've learned a system that really helps me treat my prospects like different areas of my home so that you can really hone in on what is unique to them what is their pain point what is it that is going to resonate with them because not everybody is driven by making money not everyone is driven by really impacting lives and making a difference in the world 
Not everyone is driven by having a step-by-step-by-step -step -step system. Not everyone is driven by, you know, being at the top of their company and walking across the stage and being recognized. Everyone has different things that motivate them, that drive them. So when you start to be able to recognize those things like that, you can start treating your prospects like I treat the different areas and rooms in my home for Christmas decorations. So I cannot recommend to you highly enough Debbie Morton's training, Magic Conversations, The Close. I'm going to put a link. If you guys give me some yeses down below that you want to find out about this, I'm going to put a link in the comments below to Debbie's training. And wow, I really hope you take a look at it because it has made all the difference in the world to me. So I hope you start treating your prospects like I treat the different rooms in my home for my Christmas decorations. Take care, guys. See you soon. Bye.